Swansea McKelly here for Midnight Madness TV and we are in Loughborough for the Loughborough Qualifier and I've got some hoopers, some hoopers are here to join us today. How excited are you to have the opportunity back to play basketball alongside the men? It is actually quite exciting because last year we had to play with the boys as well but um, it's good that we've got our own qualifying round as well so that's good. Nervous playing today, but I'm thoroughly enjoying it. It's good to have like a good female community like in basketball because you don't really get a lot of girls playing. It's quite a male-dominated sport, so it's good to see a lot of females come out today and doing their thing on the court. Sometimes when I play against the guys, they're just like laying off, and these girls are going. I, I was like, whoa, I've got a step. <laughs> but it was crazy. Everyone was excited and hyped. Good. I think now that we've got our own, like everyone's ready to put on their boots and ball, more girls are coming out, increasing participation, I think it's great. I'm joined with the Golden Ticket winners for the Women's Qualifier. Congratulations all of you. How important is it for female basketball to be now, you know, have a qualifier of its own? Um, you know, it's very, very important. Um, a lot of girls I've been wanting this kind of opportunity, so now there's a lot more today, um, and hopefully London, hopefully, you know, it's, it's a great opportunity for all of us though. Yeah, London's supposed to be looking a lot bigger, like I think a lot of females are going to be there, like I know, I know a lot that are going, so it should be even better than today I think. A lot more intense and more competition, I'd say. Um, well, today marked the start of the women's qualifiers. Um, you must be proud as a, as a coach yourself and as a female, really, that the women's got the opportunity to have their own qualifier. I was well happy because, uh, you know, I saw players from Manchester, Loughborough, London, all over the place. And to see 25, 26 girls turn up, it made me happy because there was no girls last year and they wanted why. So I think they made a, a count today. Like, you know, it was real good. And I know London's going to be mad. You know, Midnight Man is, is going to be off the chain mad, so I can expect about at least 50 girls. My hand on heart, yeah? <laughs> now you have such a great relationship with all the players, female players. Um, it must be really exciting for you to think, well these guys could play in London or in Loughborough, get their golden ticket and be off to the Caribbean. I mean, what is it like as a relationship with those players for you to watch back and see these girls grow? Well, for me it's good because I had a lot of them when they were younger. To see them now playing and, you know, competing to go to the Caribbean, it's great. Well, perfect. Thank you very much for your time and all your effort and hard work coaching these girls. Honestly, it really does pay off when you get to something like this, right? Um, well, thank you very much. We'll be seeing you in London again and yeah. then for the finals. and entertainment and to keep up to date with all the madness there's only one thing to do subscribe to our youtube channel